Hello everyone, this is RTXD. And this is Triggy J. How you and doing? And today we are doing a video about the new game mode which has come out with the Pyro update. That is special delivery on a map called Doomsday. Currently the only map for said game mode. But presumably there are going to be more maps for it in the future, which is good because I I like it, it's quite fun. So basically the idea is the idea is that you've got um, a briefcase from Australian rather than intelligence, I keep calling it intelligence accidentally because you know, briefcase. Yeah, usually we do have the intelligence rather than Australian, but it does look it looks pretty much the same. Yeah. With a bit attached onto it. Our the heavy is currently is that... ad currently carrying the Australian, which is oh yeah, you're the heavy, okay. Totally me. <laughs> yep. All right, let's well do let's it. do it. Wait, we. Yeah, the idea is that you stand on this elevator and you put the Australian, We're with the Australian. into the top of this rocket. Yeah, the yellow bit over there which opens, opens up oh, when you reach the top. Off. There's a game of standing on this lift for as long as possible, and as you were about to see. Presumably, this round, this this game mode, can Ow, be either spy. very very short, or it can last a very very long time. This was an example of an extremely sh short, short game, where we won very quickly. But if both teams are either extremely competent or extremely incompetent, then it can last a very it can long last time. Hour. I think I think uh, the longest game I've had of this has lasted for about. Half an hour to 45 minutes, and I'm pretty sure it goes on for even longer. Because there is so. there is no time limit on this at all whatsoever. So it just keeps yeah, going. Yeah, I think this is you're kind of attacking everywhere and defending everywhere at once. Because you got uh, you know you're thinking about hmm, be trying to capture the Australian. Should I be defending it? Should I be defending the rocket? Should I be trying to capture the rocket? You're you're, you're kind of everywhere at once, and it. Turns into a massive, massive Spy. kill fest. Really, it's kind of like uh, it's like you know, loads of people go on King of the Hill just to sort of, sort of death match, and it's very simple. There's just a control point, and if it's not in your possession, you capture it. If it is, you defend it. And it's like that, except the objective is a lot more complicated. There's a lot of places that you need to be. Oh no, I need to be over here. Now I need to be over there. Now I need to be doing this. Now I need to be doing something else. It all gets very confusing. It has to be actually so, one of the biggest maps, which is pretty interesting. It's uh, it's very interesting. It's very fun, and I'd like to see some more maps for this. That would be absolutely fantastic. Ouch! Ouch! I saw that. Yeah. I thought he would be less on the ball than he actually was. Yeah. Yep. I'm I'm currently carrying the Australia. I'm getting to the rocket. Uh, I'm I'm, uh, I'm almost there. I'm there. There we go. I seem to be the 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 way oh the wow! Works, the, way the, way, the way the Australian works is that um, the team that picks it up, then when if they drop it, it will it will either when they drop it, then only the team that was the team of the person who dropped it can pick it up for a little while. Then it will go back to the place where the Australian spawns. Way Ouch. back on the other side of the map. I think I think the lift just uh, just yeah, crushed me. Yeah, the lift me. just stomped your head. <laughs> I, just <laughs> noted, I just saw that. Uh, yeah, the, and then the only person who can raise the elevator is, is the, the one the who has the Australian. Yeah, there is and, actually uh, a little, a little, so a little not, time. So it's not it's not worth everyone sort of swarming the um, swarming the elevator. Although uh, it could be could be beneficial. But it's not necessary. I mean, you can still raise the elevator as long as you have one dude on it. There used to actually be a bug where the top of the rocket actually was already open for you, so people it's, can just kind of yeah. rocket jump up there and. Or, or uh, I get think in after it's after it's opened once, maybe. Yeah, uh, I, then I, don't, you I don't know. I've, I've seen, I saw a video where a, a dude just um, rocket jumped to the top of it and slam dunked it in there without raising the elevator, but I don't know whether that was bug or whether that's just that works sometimes I'm not sure but uh, yeah very fun game mode twisty passages yeah this is actually this is actually pretty fun it's um oh, the way I see it, it's a mixture between uh, control points and uh, kind of capture the flag it's, and yeah I, I see what you mean that's 
pretty legit. Yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to hide from. Oh oh god. Oh that's crazy. Yeah. Once you have the Australian, it, it's like half, like at least half the team are already trying to kill you. Snipers, sentries, demo men. Demo men are very vital in this game mode because they can use their stickies to put on the elevator or the or the where the Australian is. And um, actually, did, did we already explain how how the, how to get the Australian on the other team if the other team well. If our team, for example, already has it, did we explain that? I. Uh, well, wait. What? Did, what? What are you talking? What are you talking about? You mean, you mean like? Uh, so let's say I have the Australian, and the enemy team want the Australian. How do yeah, they get it? We, yeah, we we kind of we kind of went over that in the fact that only the team that only the team that you know the it's I, team I, it's team locked until until it goes back to the place where it was from. There's a little timer that counts down. It's five seconds, something like that, until the Australian goes back to the spawn right point. Well, I, I just chased this, this spy with my frying pan and I finally got him. <laughs> but then I died. But then, that was fun. I like frying pan people. Frying panning. It's pretty fun. And, uh, yeah, I don't know what this guy's doing. Well, come on, guy. Get on, get on the elevator. What are you doing? Get, get on there. Dude! Dude! You've got the Australian! Australian! Get, get over there! That's something that's pretty annoying at the moment in this game. There's a lot of people running around who do not know what they're doing. And it can frankly be infuriating as you see a guy running around with the Australian going, I don't know, I, uh, what am I doing this? Uh, I got this thingy on my back, but I just uh, go, go kill people. It's what, it's what you do, right? Uh, I really don't think this guy realizes. I'm hitting him with a frying pan. I'm trying to get him to notice that he's got the Australian. But he's just standing above his dispenser. He's, I think he's hitting me back, or he's hitting, yeah, he's hitting the dispenser, he's leveling it up, but, uh, we, we really need you to get up there, dude. Okay, he's moving. He's, he's putting his mini sentry down. Oh, that's what he's, maybe he's doing, he's, nope, he's, he's just running back and forth. Okay, that's cool. In all honesty, there are a lot of people there, but. Hang on. Whatever. You know, I, I would appreciate if you could just go on the elevator, do, do your work. Ow! That was a crit rocket right there. Okay. Well, yeah, I'm I'm playing scout as you can see. I'm using the short stop, the mad milk, and the frying pan, along with my various hats and stuff. I'm very appreciative because earlier today RTXT found a frying pan for me, which is good because I don't know what I did with my other frying pan. I probably crafted it into something. There yeah, it is, frying pan. Oh, they got, oh, wow, what the hell was that? I just, I did, see, I don't really know my way around this map. <laughs> I just tried to go backwards, and I got stuck on something. I have no idea what it was. But, yes, actually, this is a pretty cool map. It's pretty big, pretty twisty, lots of corridors and lots of open spaces, too. It's, um... Uh, what did no, you I'm just type out I'm there? I'm not going to heal him. I'm not going to heal him. Fruit, salad, something or other? I, I, was, I got confused. The guy, the guy, oh, the guy with the Australian fruit salad. With the Australian who is just not capturing it. I'm gonna hit him until he until he understands that he just doesn't have it. I mean, does I mean he does have it? And um, I think he's gonna die pretty soon because uh, the enemy I is really taking so. stuff. I really hope so. Yeah, he's got, he's got taken out. for that. Someone take the Australian before before the enemy team get it. Um, I saw it was probably gonna go, so I tried to medic my way towards it, but. Uh, and yeah, by the way, guys, this is live commentary. We have no idea how long this is gonna take. We're just gonna, <laughs> we're just gonna. I think we'll finish out this round and then call it a day. To be honest, because we don't even know this no, round this is, is ever an gonna finish. One of those rounds that's just dragging on a little bit. I mean, obviously, the first round that that we did, uh, where no, Tricky J uh, carried it. Thank, thank goodness you got the Australian. Okay, I'm moving up there, but I don't think I'm gonna last very long. There's a mini. This is level three sentry over there. And I'm pretty sure. Oh, I just saw a demo man and a sniper finally hit me. The snipers, yeah. This this is actually a very interesting map. I think Valve actually tried to make it so it's friendly to all classes in such a way. Snipers Sadly, can fire snipers, off at a distance. The snipers and, uh, still kind of stand in the exact same spot all yeah, the time, that's true. rather than moving that's about true. a little bit, which would be nice to see. I've seen sort of three or four snipers just standing outside their spawn. Being snipers. Uh, this this not this uh, soldier and I are apparently getting very annoyed with the snipers. Oh, the drop zone. Let's go get back the Australian. 
as a scout, I have that is my job. I am fast. I have to get there before anyone else does. Although oh, God, it's it worth noting that uh, the scout does not have the two times capture rate that he does on most maps. On yeah, this is not one of those things. Very true. Yeah. <laughs> I just made that soldier think I was going around the other way. The sniper again, again. That guy. That guy. I think the lift is healing me. Yeah, the, the lift the does lift, heal you. Yeah. The lift heals you. I if didn't you realize were. that. If that is if the Australian carrier is on the lift, then yeah, it does do that. I totally didn't. I totally didn't. Are we, didn't are, we know that. are we getting up there? Are we up there now? I am. Yeah. Oh, is that you up there? Spy cap. Spy cap. Spy cap. I can see a. There's a scout, but he's not the one with the Australian. Damn down. Okay, uh... Anyway, that's that, uh... that's pretty much it from 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 there. Pretty much it from from us. This is. Oh wow. Okay. Um. That is I was gonna say exploding. while this is the end of the Pyromania update videos, it's not the end of our videos by any means. We're gonna be doing more Team Fortress 2, more Battlefield, more everything over the summer because we've still got plenty of time. And of course, the Ocarina of Time. Uh, I'm sorry. I mean Ocarina of Time playthrough <laughs> is going to continue. Everything. We we're just Hopefully gonna have. Hopefully, we're gonna figure everything. out that whole color issue, and so it's gonna look a lot nicer. But uh, you know, with any luck. Did you want to close out the video? I think that is it from us for now. But yeah, like we said, a lot more coming up. So yeah, please subscribe, like our videos if you like, give us feedback, tell us what you think about the update. And the new game mode, because we are interested to know your opinion. But yeah, that is it from us for now. I just wanna, I'm just want to frying pan this guy, see if I can get him. Oh, I got him. Okay, well, well see me with, with the frying with pan, master, I took down all the enemy <laughs> team's intelligence carriers with <laughs> ambassador's shot. Me meanwhile, I was just frying pan this one guy. But anyway, with that frying pan kill, that is goodbye from us for now. Oh, see you okay. next time, and guys. another one. Okay, see you guys. <laughs>